This is the Army Today. Suicides in the Army continue to rise at a rate above the national average. Army Secretary John McHugh addressed what the leadership is trying to do to reverse this terrible trend. Yeah, this is uh, one of the most uh, difficult challenges uh, that we're facing amongst several difficult challenges. And it's, it's one that certainly from a personal per perspective breaks my heart. Uh, we do so much, everything we think we can to take soldiers into theater, provide them what they need, and to have them come home and take their lives by their own hand is just, it's heart-wrenching. Uh, and um, the frustrating part about it is, uh, both in the civilian as well as the military sector, there's, there's just no uh, evident answers. Uh, but for those of us in the Army, we're, we're trying to use every tool available. Uh, we're doing uh, multiple research programs, uh, both uh, using our own internal capabilities as well as outside expertise. Uh, we're spending about $55 million uh, over a five-year period for what's called a longitudinal study through the Institute of Mental Health, uh, the largest study of, of suicide and, and, as far as we know, the history of medicine, trying to better understand what, what the, the vulnerabilities are, uh, what can be done for earlier intervention, uh, what kinds of programs will work, who we need to keep uh, an eye on particularly. Uh, but most importantly, what we do know is that it takes soldiers watching after soldiers. Uh, we try through our various uh, training programs to, to teach soldiers what to look for, how to identify a, a buddy who's you know, having a tough time, and break away the stigma that reaching out for help is okay. And that's the Army Today.